What's up, Wargamers? Welcome back to World of Wargaming. I'm Isaiah. Today, we're going to be playing another game of Chrome Hammer Ascension, one of my favorite games right now. I kind of just want to play it all the time, but I want to play other games too. It's a, it's a constant battle within myself, but this is our fourth campaign turn. We're heading out to the outskirts of the Mega City, to the markets of Dirt Town, to deal with some Corpo Sabo. But before we do that, if you haven't considered hitting that like, subscribe, or bell notification, please consider doing that as it does two things that are really awesome. One, it helps the channel grow, and two, it helps us bring down Corpos, which, I mean, that's what we're here for. Now let's get into this game of Chrome Hammer Ascension. What's up, folks? So the crew is heading out to the market in Dirt Town for some type of yet-to-be-determined biz. But first things first in the campaign turn, we need to pay our upkeep. So we got 2d6, take the low one. One outstanding we'll on the city event, getting a 12 blackout. Blackout, a random crew member's clone is destroyed. So we got a d6, reroll the six. Five is, of course, Felix, the only one who actually had a clone. No one has three tags. I think the most I have is one tag currently, so no one's going to get doxxed and nobody's going to get jumped. Yep, 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 yep. Uh, the plan. One or six. So we can do a sabotage or an astral pain. Huh. Well, I did the sabotage last time, so we'll do the astral pain. This Engage in some consumerism. Getting a 34. I think I'm going to try to steer clear of the dope for now. Not looking to buy any chrome right now. Not looking to make any bribes. We will do some research. That is a 7. Which is minus 1. It's target number 8, but minus 1 for hackers. So that will work. Let's see what we get. A 5. Nothing yet again. Personal business. Rehab. Nobody needs to go to rehab. We're good there. Uh, all right, let's get to the job. Well, as it turns out, Astral Pain requires me to have a mage in the party, which I do not currently have a mage in my crew. So we're going to default to the other scenario and play Sabotage. If we get digital damage, which is what we, the last mission, we'll just, we'll reroll that. We'll do something different. All right, so we'll do something different. Five, Demolitions. Assault an inanimate object until it is destroyed. So we'll roll for our glitch. Getting a 22 high alert. For high alert, the corporation starts with an extra guard. Reinforcements and protocols are activated for every four response points instead of five. All right, so my objective that I'm trying to blow up is here. My punks have started hidden on their tail edge. Now, I did something different here. Now, I looked through the book for a little bit, and I couldn't really find an answer for me. When missions say that you just start hidden, I feel like starting with six health, stealth, every time for everybody was a bit much so i'm going to try it with just randomizing everybody's stealths so that's what i've done here so we're at two two six five and one just gonna play around with it see what happens i might like it and keep doing it i might dislike it and stop doing it one other thing that i'm going to try to remember to do is i want to play around with moving the cars so during the intern when the cars are on the map I'm going to move them forward, and eventually they'll just kind of wrap around and come back around the other side of the board. Just to, I don't know, I've been thinking about it for a little bit. want to see how it plays. So we're going to get to it. Uh, Rocco is going to move out. Or no, we're going to see how many orders we get. So we get four orders. Rocco's going to move out. An extra two Kit inches. is going to move out. An extra one Felix inch. Felix is going to move out, try to get himself into a position. He got a two move forward to here and then use my remaining movement to parkour up onto the top of that stuff Johnny will move out getting a six heading out to here which will bring us to the first enemy phase where we'll get the base four guards that the mission says plus one because of the high alert. will regain his stealth because he wasn't in line of sight when he started his movement he'll move up and he'll try to scan on kit fail he needed a one two we'll do the exact same thing he fails. This fellow will move four and scan. No stealth regain for him. That is a fail, lucky for me. Guard leader will move up and scan. 
Uh, no, because he needed at least a two there because that's more than nine inches. And then over here, we'll move up four. We'll try to scan down that way, needing a one, no, a two. That is a two, so I'll lose two stealth we'll on Johnny. We'll expose Johnny, giving them two response points because I had, no, one response point because I had one Vehicles stealth. have moved, orders. That's a four and a one, so we'll take the four orders. So Kit is going to move her six to right there. No, to right there. And we'll move out to grab a little bit of cover beside this slow rolling van. And he's going to take shots down here. Looking for a nine. That is a 10. That will hit and deal six damage. Outstanding. I think that'll take that car patrol. Back. And then scan down this way. I'm going to be plus one for height, but minus one for range. So looking for a seven, I believe. All right, so looking for a nine here. Oh, that is box cars. So we will expose this guard. Bring it, kit moving, or copperhead moving out. And in right one. here, and bringing us to the enemy phase. So we're going to start, I guess, back over here again. We're going to start on this side. Guard will move forward and scan. He's looking for a two at Rocco. That's a one. So that will succeed and pull one stealth off Rocco. That guard, the leader, will advance under this vendor stall. Take a shot here. He's looking for a two because I am obscured by intervening. That is a four. That is a miss. But we are in firefight range, so I can shoot back at him. I'll be looking for a be looking for a seven here because I'm minus one because I didn't move, plus one because of intervening. That is a six, which will not hit. This fellow will defend away, heal up a point of damage. Both of these guys moved up, couldn't see anything to scan, so moved up again. So we'll move some cars and we'll get they the ride in the strip. They're cruising slow. Orders six. That's going to mean everybody. Get a little bit gully here. Johnny's going to move up and take a shot at that. I'm going to try to finish that one off. I need a nine here. Oh, that is a six, unfortunately. He's going to carry out and try to get into this See box. See if we can get in there. Seven. Nope. It's target number eight. So I failed. So I'll take one D3 direct. Of course, I take move three. up with an engage. And try to take a shot down the range at that looking point. for a seven here because long range but oh no wait no it will no, be a seven right. i'm plus two minus two here so seven. Oh man lane Kid lane is gonna move out it moves six. out 13 to here um does roll a six so she'll lose one stealth down to four and rocco is gonna move out for two moving out seven to right there We'll go to the enemy phase where they're going to get to do Moving some stuff to Scanning me. on a four. That is a five. Lucky. I got super lucky there because she was within three inches of him where she was. Um, that'll trigger a close call, which means I lose one stealth immediately, which will expose me. So he will carry on with an assault. All right. I'm probably going to win that. Yes. That would be a win for me. I would go to two, but he would go further down, I guess, to zero because um, of swinging over the tag. Guard would take two damage and then retreat away. This guard here will engage over and take a shot at Felix. That is a five. Lucky for me. Also, we're going to shoot back. Gonna shoot back at him. I didn't move. So that goes to six. When higher ground goes to five, he is obscured, goes to six oh man that guard proceeds to defend away these guys are going to do some things so this guard will move engage here and take shots at johnny so he's alerted so four he's looking for a two here he's at a four long range and obscured that is a miss and i'm outside of firefight range this guy will stay right where he is 
and shoot here. So he's currently at a five because he's starting sh starting hidden and he hasn't moved. However, I am slightly, I am obscured a little bit. So he's looking for a four. That is a four. That is max damage. Oof. Ouch. Kit is hurting now having taken seven damage and that will expose himself. We also have a thing coming from a squad here. of dragon troopers coming in in this corner they are squad three but i only have four of these models and in case i roll another one i want to make sure i've got enough to represent them on the table and two is the lowest that we can represent a squad with and we're gonna move some cars and go to some this orders. guy is just cruising showing off his sweet van but this dude behind him this blade runner behind him he's he's in a hurry Ooh, that's pretty bad okay <laughs> Oof. Did that one order i've got to do something with kit so kit is gonna lay low and she's gonna move into this shack where she will regain a stealth and the next turn she can regroup and get some gonna out. move four and looking scan. for a four that is a two so we'll lose two stealth on rocco and add two to the response meter taking this it he's gonna stay right where he is and engage with felix because he can see him so he didn't straight three here. That is a five, which will fail, but I do get to shoot back. And I think I finally hit there. That will hit and deal two damage and knock the guard out of position. This friend is gonna stay put and shoot at Johnny. Uh, looking for, he's at a, he's at a three. Goes to two, goes to one, because I'm more than nine away. That is a miss. Uh, this friend, who can no longer see anybody, will move to the towards the exposed enemy, which is Johnny, and pop a shot, also looking for a one here. That is a miss. And I'm out of firefight range, so nothing there. This guard regrouped, and that guard shot and missed. Dino Fellows will move this way and it will move and take a shot at johnny as well this is going to be on a one that is a one so that'll deal point of vehicles shot. and orders okay there's a decent turn everybody's going to get to do stuff awesome right, so kit is going to regroup and johnny no we'll do we'll do rocco next rocco's going to move out Five. Rocco comes to right there, still hidden behind that guy, sneaking up on him. Felix going to pop shots at the fellow. Um, seven, I'm at a six right here because I didn't move, and I'm elevated. That is a six, which will deal damage. One damage. Will shoot back at me. I'm looking for a... Two, because I'm cover. That is a miss. Copperhead's gonna move out. For gonna one. go six to right there. Uh, Johnny is gonna move, engage. So he's gonna move down to here, and he's gonna pop a shot there. Looking for a a and eight, because they got cover. Oh, yes, buddy. That is an eight. Let's see how much damage we do. Five damage. That's a pretty good shot. He is going to shoot back at me. Oh, no, wait. No, he won't. The He'll try guys. to run away. This friend cannot see Felix because of his position. However, he can move to the edge here and take a shot at Johnny. It will be a two because of range. And that is a two. Here, we'll continue to shoot at Felix. He will miss. Felix will fire back and hit three plus three that'll take him to six not quite dead but getting Star real we'll course. defend away dino troopers will move up and take a shot at johnny they're on a one here because of range and That's correct cover that is a miss and i'm out of firefight range so i can't fire back uh, our friend over here however He's going to poke his head out and try to do some work. Six to here, pokes his head out, and he'll take it's a shot at firefight range, so it'll be a one. That is a miss. Orders. Four orders. That's 
Except we're going to start with Rocco or Felix shooting at that guard leader. That is a miss. Guard leader will get to shoot back. Looking for a two. That'll hit for one. Kit is going to regroup again. Taking her to three. We're move out with Copperhead. Five. Gonna engage. And I want to move to here. Because at their, that rate, I'm in firefight range of both of these. They have a better chance of hitting me, but I have a better chance of hitting shoot them. At this fellow looking for an eight. That is a nine. We'll hit him. See if we can finish him off. I need a five here to kill him. Ooh, boom, dilly, dead guard. That was awesome because I really didn't want him shooting me because I wouldn't have had cover from his shot. So he's dead. Johnny's gone. That's one, two, three, four activations. We'll go to enemies. This one will move up, stay hugging that cover from that passing car. Take a shot at Johnny. He will miss because of range. Uh, this guy over here is going to shoot at Felix. Looking for a one or a two. That is a miss. Felix will get to fire back. That is a hit. And yes, that's a hit. And damage. Don't roll a one. Son of a gun. Oh, no, wait. No, no, no. It didn't matter what I rolled there. He was at six. They only have seven. So that is also a dead guard. Outstanding. That that that's good because now Rocco can come and and Scarred. do that. We'll shoot at Johnny, looking for a two. That is a one. He will deal a point. Of he'll get to return fire. That will absolutely hit for five. Good lick. And this guard will defend away. Ooh. Orders six. Beautiful. We're gonna move Rocco out this way towards that terminal five that's just i just need to get him to base to base with it so that he can try to hack it next turn uh felix is going to engage and he's gonna move right here to this edge shoot that guy on the top of the head looking for a six that is a three the fellow will get to return fire and miss. Johnny is going to shoot at the Dino Wranglers. Six. Nope, that will not hit. Um, they will shoot back at him. Looking for a two. Not get it. Um, this friend will come back into the fray. He's going to move Getting it right here, hugging that barrier for cover, and he'll take a shot at Johnny looking for a one. That is not a hit, and it's out of firefight range, so nothing will happen there. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What am I doing? I wasn't done with my stuff. Well, we know what he's going to do. Copperhead's going to break cover, shoot at this guy. So I'm looking for a seven. Seven goes to eight for cover, goes back to six. That is a hit, and I have the heavy pistol, so this is plus one damage. That's three damage, which is enough to slay that guard. It will also, however, trigger a... It'll take me up. She had four stealth on her, I believe. Kit is going to regroup one Raise more time. the enemies. Again, he already did his thing, so we'll start here, where he's going to engage... Um... Try to grab a little bit of cover for the time being, at least. And he'll shoot at Felix. And miss. Felix will return fire. Looking for a... Five? Nope, that is a miss. Felix is not shooting too great today. These fellows will shoot at Johnny. Looking for a two. That is a one. That'll deal a point in. We'll return fire. Uh, five... Nope, wait. Seven is eight. Nope, that is a miss. We will get a protocol. Two is sus. Says every cor corpo will make a free scan at any punk that is hidden and in line of sight. However, there aren't currently any. Oh, no, that's not true. This one can make a scan at Rocco, but none of the others are going to be able to see him where he's at. So that guy. 
We're more than 10 away. We're not. There. We're not more than 10 away there. Uh, so four goes to three because of the Looking for a three. That is a five. Nothing All will right, happen. Let's get some orders. Five. Perfect. So everybody gets to do stuff. Okay. Um, let's start with Rocco. Rocco's going to do a carry out. So target number seven to hack that terminal. That is a 10. So we're going to hack it and we're going to get two pay data. Okay. So we're going to start off with... We already did Rocco. We're going to go with Felix next. And Felix is going to shoot this guy? No. He's going to shoot this guy. So it'll be a seven because plus one, minus one for my elevation, plus one for the range. That'll hit. And deal five damage, which I think will take out the Dragon Ken troopers. They are HP seven. That will remove them from the board. Beautiful. That worked out really, really well for me. Uh, next, we're going to move out with Johnny. You need One right there so that I can regroup next. He's going to move out this way. Taking her to One. right there, which leaves Copperhead, who's going to engage. She's going to move up. She's got seven, so I can move her. Plenty. Yeah. Put her right there. And it'll be plus one, plus one. So target number eight. Ooh, that unfortunately will not hit. They will get the firefight back at me. Looking for a two. Where'd I Found put it? Dice? That will not hit. Okay. Enemy phase. This guy is going to... Fall back to cover, I think, and shoot. Shooting from here, looking for a three. That's a miss. We are still in firefight, so I will shoot back. Six. We'll hit. Um, so, damage. Four. This guy will shoot at Copperhead. Looking for a two. Nope. I'll return fire. That will hit for two damage because I'm plus one with my heavy Back pistol. to orders. Five. Perfect. Everybody gets to do stuff. So, Rocco's going to move out. Making it to there. Three. Johnny's going to regroup. He's going to pop two of those damage off. Copperhead's going to shoot. Seven will not hit because of the cover. They will get to fire back, and they will hit for Felix two damage. is going to move out this way towards the objective. All right, so he basically just, I'm pretty sure he just climbs down on that movement. And then next turn, he'll move on towards the objective. Kit will move out this way. Running just inside the house right there. Uh, that is everybody. Yes, that's everybody. So bad guys. He will shoot at Felix. Looking for just a three here. That is a miss, luckily for me. I'll shoot back at him. This is going to be a 8. That is a 10. That will hit. And deal 5 damage, which will just spin up the Gatlin gun and absolutely obliterate that guard. This fellow will defend away. Try to heal up. Okay, now there is a board state situation to correct. So I've got to correct the response points. 
I thought things were off. I thought I thought something didn't seem right, and then I figured out what it was. So I'm gonna add a bunch of response points right here to the ticker, and we're gonna see what so I was forgetting to roll to add the D6 when an enemy got fragged. Um, so. All right, that's not too terrible. So that's six, eight, 10, 14. Right, so we took the response meter with that correction to 24, which gave us a Borg down here and a squad of implant infantry up top. We also got Sus, which doesn't matter because there's nobody hidden except Kit and nobody can see her right now because she's tucked in that building. Oh, that's not true. They might can see Rocco. They might can see Rocco. He's out in the open. I forgot he was still still. So he needs a uh, one. No. And then the other one was scramble. So at the beginning of the next enemy phase, all the enemies will get a free move. Six. Outstanding. Everybody gets to do stuff. Okay. Those guys I already know are, are absolutely terrifying. It's orders. We're going to start with Kit who is going to engage this fellow to assault Two. there. Ooh, shart. So it takes an immediate damage. So that's one. And then I, it gets minus one, goes to five. She got overrun again, because that was a six to a one. She's gone. You might, you, you're so pretty, Kit. You just might not be on the team too much longer. You keep letting me Rocco down. is going to move out. Okay, and he'll lose one stealth. Copperhead is going to move and engage here and start wailing on this. So I'm thing. assuming here that I just wail on this thing. I don't think it, I don't think it can hit me back. So I get a three, and that's, it has armor one, so that's minus one, so Johnny it'll take two. will move out. One. And... Felix will move out. Landing right there. We will go to the enemy phase where this enemy will defend away. Three. And heal one. Uh, Borg will gain a stealth since technically here, since both of us are more than three inches away from this linear obstacle, we can't see each other. So... He'll gain a stealth and move up. His four won't be able to see anybody, so he'll move up one more to right there. All right, so these implant infantry will move up. And they're gonna take a shot at Felix. So that's gonna be, they have plus two to their threshold, so a five, but then minus one for long range and minus one for obstruction. They needed a three, that is a four, that is a miss, and I'm way, 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 way out of firefight range. Bring us back to orders. Orders. Six, everybody gets to do stuff. Okay, let's go. So we're gonna start here. She's gonna assault the thing. That's a one, it's to a minimum of one, so that's one damage. Okay, we'll engage it. Three goes to two, so it's up to five. Rocco's gonna try to hot wire this box. So he's gonna carry out. Looking for a seven. Six does not do it, so he'll take a D3. Two damage. Felix is gonna move out this way. And then three. Gonna, oh, no, I moved out. Never mind. Yeah, so he's moving out to there. Uh, gone, gone, gone. Yeah, I only got four people on the table right now. We'll go to enemies, starting with this guy who. Should be at three right now because I removed one last time. So he will engage and peek around the ATM right here. And take a shot at Felix. Looking for a three. He's just got a wide open shot. That's a four, however, which is a miss. Felix will get to shoot back. That'll hit. Oh, yeah, that'll definitely hit. Two damage. Borg will, I think Johnny's closer and probably more of a threat. So he'll engage up 
and shoot at Johnny. Number two. That is a miss. Johnny will return fire. That's a 10. So that'll hit. Damage. One. And it has armor two, but it won't go These below. These moved. Couldn't see anybody, so moved again. Stopping right there to grab cover. Which will bring us to orders. Three. So one, somebody's not going to get to do anything. And I'm not entirely sure who it's gonna be. I think it's I think it's gonna be Rocco because he's hidden right now. So Felix is gonna open up at this thing. Oh my goodness. So let's see if I can hit it. Nope, I sure can't. Um, it is not within firefight, but it will get its stalker action and move four inches to Copperhead's gonna wail on the machine. One damage, okay. Johnny's gonna wail on the machine, but Johnny's gonna move a little bit. Move to right there and wail on the machine. Oh my goodness. Guys, okay. he will defend away again. He will engage. Grab cover, shoot. Wait a minute, hold on. Yeah. Uh, looking for a three. Miss. I'll get the fire back. Miss. Okay. In Nothing in infantry moved to here, and they will take shots at Johnny. Okay, so they're just looking for a straight three here. One will hit and deal a point of damage. Johnny gets to fire back. That'll hit. Even with them in cover, that'll hit. For five damage. There's a decent okay. roll. Orders. Six. Okay, everybody's going to get to do stuff this time. Okay. So, they're going to be defending a way to heal, so I'm not super worried about this. I'm just going to keep wailing on this thing. So, Copperhead, going to wail. Six damage. Minus one goes to five, which is the, re the requisite amount. Now, once that's done, I still have to do a thing. Well, at second turn, maybe there isn't something that I had to do. I thought there was a carryout action that I had to do. But if there was, I can't find it, or maybe I just imagine that. But that thing is dead, blown up, make a reactor, destroyed. Now I gotta get out of dirt town. So, Johnny still has an action, and Felix still has an action. Johnny is gonna move out. goodness that way no Johnny's gonna lay low so Johnny's gonna just move half around that corner out of line of sight Felix and engage, is gonna engage but he's gonna be cheeky so he's gonna fall back some and shoot at the board so he'll be looking for a big number here Nine, seven, long range, cover, seven, eight, nine, nine hits, okay. Damage, three, it's got armor two, so it'll take one, and then it'll move towards me. Rocco is gonna try to hotwire this box again. Yes, that will get in there. Let's see what we Here. get. We got a 16 is a stimulant injector. Now I have contact, so I can take the one above or the one below. And I'm gonna take the first aid kit, I think. And then we go to enemies. We'll start with the Borg. who will move up his four and shoot at three. That is a point of damage to Felix. Felix is gonna opt to fall back. Traffic is finally picking up to the fact that there's a gunfight happening between some punks and some corpos. Traffic is starting to really Orders. speed up. Everybody's going to get to go. All right. We're going to start with Copperhead, who's going to engage. So she's going to come over this and shoot at them. That's going to hit. That's going to hit big time. Okay. Four 
plus one is five, and they are armor zeros. That'll be five damage. That'll definitely kill them. They already got four on them, but it will be D6 to the response meter. So three takes us to 27, which luckily does not trigger anything yet. Outstanding. Good job, Copperhead. Um, Rocco going to move out this way. Johnny going to move out that way. Bye. Felix going to engage. No, Felix is going to move away. Move out that way. Six. So I'm just going to take him to the edge of the board. Stand there. Oh, no. Twelve. I'm going to go this way. All right. Yep. Yeah, perfect. And he's not going to leave yet. He's just going to kind of chill and wait on his friends. That'll bring us to enemies. Borg. At this point, she's closer and exposed. So I guess he would move that way. And he'll shoot a copperhead. Hitting for two. She'll fire back. Missing. This cheeky little guard will move up to engage and shoot here is he within nine he is so three. Oh goodness gracious that might frag does indeed frag me which will bring us to orders. all right two orders that's all i need oh wait i guess i get to roll two dice there though two orders that's all i need johnny's gonna move out this way we're going to move out this way. Four. Okay, these guys will both move towards Felix because he is exposed while both of them are currently stealthed. And Hit. he'll take a shot at Felix. Looking for a uh, one. Nope. And then this fellow will move up to here. Wanting to hug some cover himself. And he'll take a shot. Looking for a two. No. Bringing us back to me. Orders. Two it is. Moving out Johnny. All right, he's going to lose his stealth, become exposed, and that will trigger a protocol at the end of this phase. But he's going to keep moving. Going to move out. Also, going to give a response point. Orders from 728. Takes us to 29. Also, 2d6. Well, no, because I'm not voluntarily exposed. I'm not sure if it would be a D6, an additional D6 here or not. I'm going to say that it is, but I'm not certain. So that's another 11. So for, we got another two reinforcements and another two protocols. We got another Borg. And then we got this group of Cobol, this gang of Cobalds that I'm really, really glad I rolled because I love these models. This is the first time I've gotten to put them on the table and I think they're really, really freaking cool. And then we got Dragon Fear and Proprietary Drivers, which didn't, Proprietary Drivers didn't matter because I don't have any cybernetics. Dragon Fear means that I will start, everybody, all of my punks start stunned. So all I can do is be given a defend order. And then we'll go to the enemy phase. Yep, then we'll go to the enemy phase. Oh my goodness gracious. That's not good. <laughs> All right. So Borg will move up four and take a shot at Johnny because he's closest. Looking for a three. That's a one. So one damage to Johnny. Johnny might be in firefight rank. He is not. This Borg will move up and shoot at Rocco. That's too many dice. What am I doing? They get one dice. And he's looking for a two. That does not hit. However, I am in firefight range and I will move out. I will fall back right, away we'll from move him. up six shoot at Johnny he hits not feeling good friends uh, let's go to orders all right five so that's plenty to do something with everybody so Felix is gonna defend himself right off the board they will both defend themselves that and way. then we go to enemies so this board will move up four and shoot at Johnny. 
Looking for three. Whoo! He misses, and Johnny will fall back off the table. Uh, this Borg will move up. Just barely get eyes on Rocco. It needs a one, though. Does not get it. And then other guard will move up. And pop a shot at the fleeing Dwarfo. Man. Okay, that's a miss. I've rolled that thing right into the door of that shack so many times today. Uh, which will bring it back to me. All I need is one order, and Rocco is off the table. All right, I'm getting better at the response meter. I'm getting better. I've, I'm, I'm, I know that I've botched that up a few times in the past. I messed it up today, but I'm getting better. I don't know why. It's one of those things where I know it shouldn't trip me up as bad as it has, but it does. But I'm getting it. I'm getting it. I think, I think I'm pretty sure I got it locked in. Either way, let's get to the post game. see what happens to everybody. 2D6 gigabit coins. Three. Oh my goodness. What a what a crap paying job. And then I'll get one D6 rep for the people who lived, which were Felix, Rocco, and Johnny. So for Johnny, for Felix, and for Rocco. Let's see what happens. We can move this out of the way now. Let's see what happens to Copperhead and Kit. So Copperhead gets a 21. She is captured. Oh, snap. Um, and Kit gets a, she's fine. So Copperhead has been captured. So that means we are going to have to mount a rescue attempt on our next game. We're going to have to figure out where she's being held and we're going to get our girl. That way, we ain't, ain't going, mm -mm, mm -mm, nope, uh-uh, not today. Not today, not in this house. Nope, nope, we're going to get our friend back. We got two pieces of pay data double threes and lots and lots and lots of research not going to do any subcontracting um might have some character advancement do but i think i may i may i'm going to stew on that for a little bit uh i am going to have to recruit somebody but i will introduce y'all to them next time we play when we go to get our friend back and that brings us to repeat which brings us to the end of this game of chrome hammer ascension hope you guys have had fun rolling some cyber fantasy dice with me i know i've had a great time thanks for stopping by i hope you have an absolutely amazing rest of your day and as always i'd like to say a big huge from the bottom of my heart thank you to our patrons who support us and pledge to us over on patreon you guys are the absolute best if you enjoyed the content you saw here today and that's something that you would like to consider doing to help out the channel go over there check out the link in the description check out the patreon there's a lot of cool stuff over there including access to our discord server talk to me hang out with me talk about our work what we got going on in the hobby um some shout outs all kinds of cool stuff check it out if that's something that you think you would be into and regardless of whether or not you do that i want you to know that i am incredibly grateful that you decided to stop by and spend part of your day with me today, rolling dice and pushing toy soldiers around. I hope you have an amazing rest of your day. And as always, may the dice be ever in your favor.